Hi, and welcome to Cooking with Hoberg. Um, you might be wondering what this is. It's roughly two pounds of sirloin. Um, and today we're making chili. Kind of just mash it up. So it's all in little ground bits. Right now it's in newly bits. But through the magic of the internet, you don't have to watch all of the whole thing I'm doing. Look at how it's browning up so nicely. Look at that. Beautiful. Beautiful. Just keep mushing it up until it's all the same color. You know, I often imagine people asking me, Hoverg, how does this help me with Smash Brothers? And the answer is that, um, Mr. Game & Watch has a frying pan. So you can't expect to, uh, you can't expect to eat dinner without playing Mr. Game & Watch. We're getting pretty close. But thanks to the miracle of pan, we don't have to worry about it sticking to the bottom of the pan. What a time to be alive. No, that's almost completely brown. There's a little bit of pink left in some places, but um, we're going to be putting it in the crock pot, so we don't have to worry about that super much. Just got to get it pretty close. And we get to add in Tex-Mex chili sauce from McCormick. Now it's, uh, it says one packet per pound, so we've got about two pounds, so I figure we're pretty close to two packets. And then we're just gonna, we're gonna stir it in with that same method we used earlier to get it all brown. Just kind of work your way around the pan and flip it and stab. And it's smelling like, uh, well, it smells like chili. So, and you know, you can hear it all sizzling nice. So, we're going to go ahead and turn down the heat now. And we're going to remove it from the heat. So we got two cans of Delmont uh, diced zesty chili style. And those are just going to plop in. See, it's empty now. <coughs> now I know I didn't um, I didn't say it, but. Um, I used a can opener to open the cans. What was this that I'm, uh, I'm putting in? It's the Joan of Arc chili beans. They're spicy, but uh, I think they'll be worth it. Excellent source of fiber. So now we um, add in that stuff. Pretty easy. I'm going to add a little bit of liquid, but uh, you don't have to if you don't want to.
and in about two cups of water. And uh, give a little bit of a stir. And um, start on, uh, let's put it on medium. I guess that's it. Hooray, internet, we made jelly. That's what it looks like through the reflective lens of the, the lid. Now I know you're asking what makes my chili special. Um, I got some Old Bay. I'm gonna put that in. There's probably only a teaspoon left in there. Really, but okay because I got an extra one. I'll add uh, just a little bit more. See? Get a big old spoon and I run that through. And that's exactly what it's going to look like when it's finished. Um, because it's basically finished. So. Congratulations, Internet. You just made chili. If you followed my instructions, but were so easy to follow.